Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel and into another vlog. It's currently Sunday afternoon and I am flying to China tonight for a four day business trip. My flight is at 11.30pm tonight so I'm grabbing some dinner on the way with my husband. I haven't had grilled burgers in so long so I'm super excited to get my favourite burger tonight which is Garden Goodness and I also want to try out the zucchini fries which I've heard good things about. And off we go, my husband is dropping me off at the airport. The drive from our house is usually about one and a half hours, but at this time of the night there isn't much traffic, so we got there in about one hour. We have arrived in Guangzhou and it's very early in the morning. We are going to take a taxi to the hotel and see if our rooms are ready by any chance. I hope so, so I can freshen up before the workday starts. Alright, here is a quick little room tour before I head out. Alright, here we go. The first stop is the leather market for ready-made handbags. We come here to source ideas, inspirations and samples to take back with us. And it's already the evening now and we are on our way to dinner. Today was so fast paced that it flew by so quickly I didn't even get a chance to vlog. We went to a beef hot pot restaurant which was really nice. I finally got a chance to just chat and catch up with my colleague who I hadn't met in person until today. Good morning, it's the next day and I'm getting ready and then I'll be heading to the 30th floor to have some breakfast. Alright, it's time to start work and today we have another big day ahead. We are going to the Canton Fair which is a huge trade show where you can meet with new and existing factories and suppliers.
Later that day, we are heading out for dinner. I really wanted to eat some roast goose, which I had tried the last time I was in Guangzhou about five to six years ago. So my colleague took us to this restaurant, but unfortunately they were sold out of the roast goose when we went to order it. Oh well, I shall try to get it for lunch tomorrow. Tonight we did get some sightseeing in, despite how tired I was from two days of running around already. But the last time I was here, I didn't get to see it, so this time I was determined. The Canton Tower looked really nice lit up at night. At first we were right under it, but then my colleague said let's go to the other side of the river to see it better. We had to take a train though, under the river, as there is no way to walk across it. Day 3 and we are starting with the same hotel breakfast and then we are heading out to the markets again. The markets are huge here so it takes some time to get through them all. And we've come to the final day now. After breakfast, we have checked out from the hotel, but stored our luggage here until our flight later tonight. Hitting up the last of the markets, this time for scarves, jewelry, and hair accessories. I work in product development for a women's handbag company, but I also participate in buying for other categories. And that's a wrap for this trip. We are now at the airport to head back home. It was a super hectic four to five days, so I'm really looking forward to resting over the weekend. I hope this vlog wasn't too choppy though. I wasn't really able to vlog as much as I hoped I could, but I hope you enjoyed it anyway. That brings me to the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching till the end. If you enjoyed it, please give it a like and consider subscribing for more from me. Have a lovely day and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye!